Yo, what's up? My name is Tane, and welcome to another video. In this Making a Beat video, we will be checking out the new Behringer TD3. Woo! Goddamn, this thing is so light. But check it out. This is the silver iteration of it. I believe there is silver, blue, red, black, and limited edition yellow with the acid smiley on there. If you have heard about this thing, then you must be well aware of it because it's there's a lot of hype behind this thing. This is Behringer's take of the legendary TB303 by Roland. So it's a all analog recreation of the box at an amazing price. They've tried to stay as true to the original as possible with a few extra features. You know, there's a distortion section up here, which is pretty rad. USB functionality. The oscillators in this are gnarly by themselves. The filter is crazy, squelchy, not into the squelch, but we'll go ham on it in a second. Once again, I don't know much about these. I just like to check them out, have some fun, make some sounds, make some music. I bet you're wondering why do I have the legendary acid box when I'm making hip hop beats? Well, I'm glad you asked. We're still gonna make hip hop beats. Bro, I like a challenge. Not only have I got this thing today, I've got something else to help make this sound nuts. The plasma pedal. This thing, if you've not heard of this thing, this thing is nuts. You can't see it now, but you will see it in a moment. As you play notes, little strip lights up with a little electric plasma volt, zappy, voodoo magic doodahs. It's basically a distortion pedal. This thing is staunch. A distortion pedal to add to the TD3. This is gonna be crazy. And that's what I'm working with today. With all that being said, let's jump into the beat. So I'm just gonna sample this straight in over the drums and uh, hopefully get some cool melodies, textures, some full power. Dude, I just want some oomph today. Anyway, let's do this. So here are the drums I made. Swaggery, slow, oomphy. Let's explore the sounds of the TD3. I'm not gonna engage the plasma pedal just yet, but let's have a little play around and see what, see what it sounds like. Now you've got an idea of how that sounds by itself. Turning the distortion on, let's engage the plasma pedal. Pure carnage.
Now I'm going to start to sample this on top of the beat to see what we can come up with. So I've sampled this a little bit. I got as many sounds as I could out of it. I think I'm pretty happy with the sounds. The only thing is it's very good at just one thing. This thing is truly a one trick pony. It does it really well, but it's a bass box. <laughs> well, I did thoroughly enjoy the sounds of this one. The track needs more depth. I'm gonna play around with a few other sounds and see if I can add some more flavors and such to it, just so that uh, it's not just bass and a beat. But um, we'll see, we'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm gonna play around with my System 1 over here, 1M, and uh, see if we can get some chords, jump off and have a play around. But uh, yeah. <laughs> So there you have it. That is the new Behringer TD3. Woo! I bet you're expecting an acid house track. But look, it doesn't just do acid. It's known for its acid sounds, baseline sounds, and it does that, and it does it pretty well, in my opinion. This thing is great sounding. The oscillators alone sound really, really oomphy. There's a lot of power behind it. The filter, obviously, aggressive squelchy if acid is your jam then no doubt you'll be picking up one of these it would have been cool if they had like an lfo or something the distortion is pretty cool nice little touch to the box one of my gripes is it feels cheap it's light <laughs> this thing is so light plastic outside you know it would have been cool if they just had some something in it some weights or something in it when it just <laughs> made it feel like it's 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 a lot more valuable the plasma pedal man this thing is freaking sweet if you want gnarly distortion this thing's got power this thing is i love this thing this thing is great and just the fact that it's got this little lightning thing mm, amazing definitely worth checking out if you ever have the chance to play with one go check it out another simple unit it does one thing it does one thing really well quite happy with this as well but hey that's it for today thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you enjoyed it as much as i did making it it was lots of fun as always go check out the behringer td3 it is great i'm sure that if you're into acid music you'll be picking one up go check out the plasma pedal by game changer audio it is great if you did like this video you know what to do like subscribe and share this with your grandma a question for you today is what is your favorite tb303 
recreation, clone, emulator, what have you. What's your favorite one? Is it the original? Is it the TD3? Is it the Roland Boutique TBO3? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear it. And uh, as always, have fun, enjoy, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.